on for breaking news, traffic, and weather. Well, it's good news if you already own your own home, not so much if you're looking to buy. The latest figures from the Toronto Real Estate Board show no let-up in the escalation of house prices here in the GTA. 680's Phil Martino joins us live with a breakdown of the figures. Phil. Scott, Jason Mercer with the Toronto Real Estate Board says growth in sales continues to outpace growth in new listings. So there's been an increasing amount of competition between buyers, and that's led to that jump in prices. If you look at the average selling price for, for all home types combined in the Trev market area, um, you're seeing that average up by 33% um, in comparison to last year uh, to an average price of $916,567. Ontario Finance Minister Charles Souza has indicated there will be measures in the upcoming budget to address the housing market. Sean Ziegelstein, sales rep with Royal LePage, says it will be interesting to see what the government puts in place. I think without having the extra supply on the marketplace, any measures that the government puts into place is not going to curb the demand enough that's in place right now to help any first-time home buyers or property uh, or, or owners that are looking to either downsize or upsize a little bit because of the, just the sheer fact of inventory levels being so low right now. For now, the Toronto real estate market remains red hot, and if you're looking to buy, Ziegelstein suggests looking at alternative options like perhaps buying something smaller like a condo or looking outside of the Toronto area to the suburbs. Phil Martino, 680 News. The Mayor John Tory is expressing concern over these latest housing figures. As we hear from 680's Moment Koresh at City Hall, the Mayor says it's time for action. Moment joining us live now. Brian, all three levels of government on hand this morning as the Trudeau government announced its investments in the housing uh, market in this country. Uh, however, there wasn't a lot of specifics as to what is specifically tangibly being done in terms of dollar amounts or actual uh, technical programs that are being introduced to help combat that. But the government did make a commitment saying they, that it is a key item for them, that they are working on it. They have a long 11-year plan to make it happen. Uh, now, uh, Mayor John Tory says that something certainly needs to be done. The dream of home ownership has to be kept alive, and it has to be kept alive not just for people with means, but for people who are seeking uh, housing uh, that is more modest in terms of its price. And that is why there's a need to increase the supply of all kinds of housing, affordable rental housing, and also affordable ownership housing. For Tory, supply is one of the big causes he believes as to why the market is skyrocketing both in rental and in sales. So he's looking at something like a vacant home tax, which he found out over the past week. He has to get permission from the province to implement if that is a way the city decides to go. Now